I'm not actually here to react to Did a Bitter's video on the Odeblock drama. I'm here to, ex I, I guess, expose, just talk uh, talk on the subject of this cunt being an even bigger snake than we already know that he is. Um, I think it's quite well known that he's one of the least liked content creators in the community, at least from a viewer standpoint. He's got his clicky little friend group. Um, and it's all about strength in numbers, right? But um, I, I, don't, <laughs> I don't have time to watch this whole video because we, we know the situation and I've had the TLDR run down from you guys. I just want to talk about did a bitter in general because I have a lot of um, a lot of uh, hold on we got a sandwich lady oh it's a bread roll don't worry useless we I, I have a I have a few things I want to talk about <laughs> that I think um, the the community should know as you guys remember about two months ago about a month ago just over a month actually forty days ago roughly a video was put out on me by did a bitter okay there's been a lot of drama going on in the community recently a lot of stuff with Odeblock has been happening and it is amazing to see the amount of effort people can put into digging up dirt, exposing corruption, and uh, ju just in general, ripping into people with, with an ex a, a video about drama, right? And then it really just puts into perspective how shit his video on me was. Because his video was basically, uh, this guy subtweets me, if you just go look at, at King Condor, at, at Did A Bitter, he subtweets me, and he told me to shut up a year ago, and that was it. Okay, that's really the problem that he had with me. And he said that I fake it till I make it. He said that I um, still aren't, but I fake it till I make it, but I don't actually make it. And that I'm a, I'm a shit content creator with shit content. So I want to just bring to light quickly the numbers since the release of his video involving drama around me. And if we look at the Social Blade numbers, you can see for Did A Bitter, we're looking at about 75,000 views uh, in the month. Um, no subscribers in the last 30 days. His sub count hasn't moved. His views are, he's getting under a thousand views a day. And if you remember correctly, this is uh, lower than it was when the, the drama came out, right? When the video on me came out. Then you look at my numbers. And we're looking at over half a million views. 1.7K subs. You know, we're looking at 20,000, 14,000 views a day before even the Odeblock stuff. The Odeblock stuff started here, you know? We're still getting 31,000, 22,000. We've got a dead day. Don't know what happened there. So I just want to put it into perspective how fucking useless this cunt is before we go any further into this video, okay? He's washed up. He doesn't have a clue on how to make content. And then he's gone ahead and made a video talking about the Odeblock situation. Now, the reason I think this is a bit snaky and hypocritical, he talks about how they don't like each other. There's a clip here, which it's only about halfway through the conversation from Odeblock's stream. That was uh, screen recorded. Um, did a bit of basically went to the chat on Odeblock stream and I guess tried to be friends in there and was stating that he doesn't want to get involved in the drama. He just wants to sit back and watch, which is why I find it ironic he made this video. But um, I'm going to try my best not to laugh. There's some fucking, there's some good shit going on in this video. Check this out. Check it out. Okay. I'll try to make sure the volume's good. He's like, I don't want to be a part of this. I'm just here to watch. Like, what a fucking coward, bro. My God. And you know what's crazy? Did it better? Everybody told me you stunk at TwitchCon. I know I already said that, but I got to say it again for all the new viewers that didn't know. Get some deodorant, <laughs> motherfucker. I want to touch on that quickly. That one of the most embarrassing things that can happen in your life is going to high school and say your nudes have been leaked to high school. You know? Or, or something embarrassing has happened to high school. That's one of the most embarrassing things that happen in your life. That sticks with you. For a lifetime. I would rather have my nudes leaked at high school than be exposed as a grown ass man going to a public event and being told that I smell like shit. And this isn't just one person saying it. That's embarrassing. Hello, Kelly. Flip Mick. How you doing? Hello, this boy's on fire. What's going on? EK Palas Pal Pal Yo, Policy. How you doing? Ant, what's going on, my brother man? Hello, Ricky. What's going on? Soror, how you doing? <coughs> Bro, you've been streaming to five years and still haven't gone to a real event. You know why? So, Ditter's argument is you haven't gone to a, a reveal event or a TwitchCon or a, a RuneFest, even though you've been streaming for five years. Like, that fucking matters. This is more proof that this cunt is nothing but someone who cares about his online persona, 
If it, it, he'll only comment on things if it makes him look good. He won't respond to this video. If he does, it'll be a poor job. That's why he was immediately on his drama about me. I'm not responding to this drama because he's a fucking idiot. And I'll, I'll expose him. I'll talk about his dumb shit he does on Twitter and he will clam the fuck up. His little fuckface boyfriend, the, the come with the speech impediment, what's his name? Fucking Eliop might arc up once or twice, but he's just as fucking dumb as the rest of them. They don't know what the fuck they're talking about. The whole group, the whole, the whole, the, the whole lot of them combined struggle to hit a fucking double digit high IQ bracket half the time when you try to conversate with them. It, it's incredible how fucking dumb they are. And this is just more evidence of like just how out of touch did a bitter is with himself online. It's fucking amazing. Because I don't want to meet fake motherfuckers like you. When you guys go to that event, you guys just drink and you guys are like, yeah, dude, yeah, I'll definitely check you out. Let me drop you a follow. And you guys all act fake to one another. I'm not like that. I like to keep real to myself and I like to keep my circle small. You guys are all fake motherfuckers, most of you guys. Everything you guys do is a business relationship. You guys aren't friends. You guys just ride each other's cock and just to gain viewers off one another. That's it's it. weird. You think I want to be a part of that? Absolutely not. 100%. There's no better way Hello, Vin Rips. Hello, Eric. Sit up. Pleasure to see you, my brother, man. How you doing? Hancho, what's going on? Vitled. Q's. Moss, what's going on, my brother, man? How you doing? What, why is there so hurt? I don't know. I think I just hit him where it hurts and he saw It's true. It's absolutely true. And I mean, look, I'm, I haven't got as big of a voice as Odoblog, so to hear someone else saying the same shit I've been saying for a long time, really fucking just chef's kiss on this motherfucker. I don't really want, I don't have the time to, to, to listen to this guy. This is... This Andrew Tate sounding Beetlejuice look a motherfucker talk about some. So drama. unless you've been like, living under a rock for the past week, you would he know said that. he doesn't want to get involved in the drama. He wants to sit there and watch. Why is this here? Why have you got a Manscaped advert? I mean, this is obviously to get his Manscaped advert out there. But let's be honest, you shouldn't be advertising Manscaped if it comes to aftershave. You're not fucking using it. You should practice what you fucking preach. One hundred percent. Get a Rexona advert or some shit. This kind of stinks in public. I don't really want to watch this cunt's video, but I thought I'd just put this out there. Say my piece. I'll re-upload it to YouTube so you can all see it. Did a bit of 100% stinks at public events. And it's fucking amazing. <laughs> this is the easiest room in the raid. It's quite simple. You got a big boy. Look at him. God damn. Fuck, mate. Look at that boy. It's huge.